Anthony here from Kalardioscope with a, another haul from Sephora that I picked up just recently. Uh, thank you for coming back and thank you for joining me if you're a new subscriber. These are just a few things I picked up recently while I was at Sephora, nothing, not for any special reason, just happened to be there, happened to see them, couldn't help myself. I'm pretty sure you've all been through that. You go to Sephora, you're looking for one thing and they don't have it so you buy everything else you could possibly put in your little basket that's how they get you to Sephora they go would you like a basket and you go sure why not and then you have to fill the whole basket it happens it's okay let's do this first section I went to while I was there that day was the NARS section because you know I'd pick up a couple things for my wife from NARS anywho uh, first of which was this NARS high definition blush powder in the color Albatross well, you know what the NARS packaging looks like. In Albatross, let me open this up so you can actually see the color itself. NARS Albatross is a highlighter, actually, not a blush. But this is the color of it. Albatross, nice highlighter. Light color. Comes out really beautifully on all skin tones, so go check that out while you're at Sephora. Next thing I want to go pick up was the Larger Than Life Longwear Eyeliner Pencil in uh, Rue Bonaparte, NARS eyeliner pencil. My wife actually likes to use this color in her waterline. Let me just show you the color I'm talking about. This is it. This is the color Rue Bonaparte right here. Uh, looks like this. Ooh. This is the color. I don't know if you can see that on my skin. Rue Bonaparte. Nice flesh tone color right there. It's very smooth. Very silky. I like it. Okay. Um, that was one of the two things I actually went in to pick up. The other is the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. Uh, in the color Light Chantilly. I believe this is color number one. The lightest color they have in this. This is, uh, let me show you. This is it. Light Chantilly. That is the color we're looking at. Let me swatch that for you real quick. And this is the color right here. Light Chantilly. Right underneath my Rue Bonaparte swatch right there. And this, like I said, is a radiant creamy concealer. So this is good stuff. Wow, that's actually really good stuff. Um, Next item I saw while I was there was actually a limited edition uh, cheek palette right here. This The NARS limited edition uh, cheek palette in the color Foreplay, which is this four pan right here. It actually has the regular NARS packaging inside, but this is the special edition cover. That one actually looks like this on the inside. Let me open this guy up for you. Uh, you know, regular NARS packaging and the inside looks like so. Wow, that's pretty. This is what it looks like on the inside. These are the four colors. These are all based on the color Orgasm by NARS also. Um, that's beautiful. I don't even know if she's going to use it right away or if we're going to hang on to it because it's collector's edition. Uh, probably going to use it. I'm pretty sure she will. Okay, next item I saw while I was was this other uh, limited edition set. This is the And God Created Woman Eye Kit. Pretty decent size eye kit right here. It's called And God Created Women. I know it does come with a, a Pro Prime smudge proof eyeshadow base, one of these little guys here, and also a brush, brush, cute little NARS brush. Uh, this is what the palette actually looks like, you know, of course, regular NARS packaging. And this is what it looks like on the inside, the eyeshadows it comes with right there. Look at that, that is a beaut. Had to pick it up, now you see why I had to pick it up, because that is some special, special colors. So that is one of the uh, palettes I picked up. The other two pieces I picked up from NARS, these limited edition sets, uh, this is the NARS Guy Bourdain collaboration. This is the Promiscuous Lip Pencil set that comes with a little, uh, this comes in a uh, limited edition blue faux leather pouch, looks like this on the back. It comes with five uh, lip pencils. Let me uh, just show this to you real quick. It comes with a little faux leather lip pouch, that's very cute. This is what the colors of, well, individually wrapped. That's how you like to see it. Uh, these are the colors it comes with. First uh, pencil it comes with is this uh, Velvet Lip Gloss Lip Pencil in the color New Lover. Uh, it looks like this. This is the color right here. Beautiful color right there. New Lover, that's the first pencil. The second is this Dolce, this Velvet Matte Lip Pencil in the color Dolce Vita. That's the color right here. I'll take the cap off for you. That is the color of the pencil right there. That is very, very nice. Matte lip pencil. Never have too many of those, right? The next one is also a uh, velvet matte lip pencil in the color Cruella. This is the color right here, Cruella. Let me show you the color of the actual pencil itself. Right there. 
Oh, that is a beautiful, beautiful color. Uh, also coming up here is a uh, Velvet Matte Lip Pencil in Sex Machine, right there. Colors Sex Machine. And the final color here is uh, Never Say Never. Look at that. That's a beautiful, beautiful color right there. Never Say Never. So that's what comes with it. The four Velvet Matte Lip Pencils and the one Velvet Gloss Lip Pencil. And that faux leather bag. Perfect. Cute little makeup pouch. Uh, the other Guy Bourdain piece I found is is this piece. This is the Guy Bourdain One Night Stand Blush Palette. It looks like this, the box itself. A little risque, but uh, very nice, very exciting. Uh, let me open this up and you guys have a quick look at this. The inside is the special edition Guy Bourdain. And yes, Guy Bourdain, not Anthony Bourdain from the Travel Channel. It's a totally different dude. So. That is what it looks like on the outside. Let me open this up so you guys can have a look at the blush colors inside. And these are the colors that come in here. The One Night Stand Cheek Palette. Uh, this is what it looks like. There's the blush and the bronzing powder in there. Hope you can see that. There you go. Perfect. So that is also a limited edition one. You know, sometimes when you go past that NARS section, you're really not sure what there is. Make sure you look at the top shelf. That's where they keep all the limited editions. So, next section I went to after that, was actually looking for a couple things, was Benefit, uh, next one along. So, I actually went in there to pick up was Dandelion, this is my wife's favorite color from the blushes, or not her favorite color, but her go-to color when she's in a hurry. Uh, this is the color Dandelion, if you're not sure. Uh, let me open that up for you to see it, that's the color Dandelion. Very light, beautiful color. That's what I went in there for, of course. And uh, while I was there, I was enticed into picking up, up Sugar Bomb which is this color right here, Sugar Bomb. Let me open that up so you can have a look at the inside. Uh, this is what Sugar Bomb looks like on the inside. Perfect, right? It says, Sugar Bomb is your Sugar Rush flush. For a pop of color, swirl face shades together, then sweep on cheeks and face. Mmm. That's really cute. That's really good. Um, that's why I picked it up, because it's like a multi-purpose blush and highlighter. Uh, the other thing I picked up there, I've heard a lot about this, is the Rockateur. This blush, I'm sure you've heard a lot about this on YouTube so far. This is the color Rockateur in there. It says rock on there. That's pretty awesome. It says uh, sweep this provocative powder on your cheeks. It's a sl let's just slow. It's a show-stopping flush. So that is the Rockateur. Beautiful, beautiful color. And as always, these come with the uh, little brushes. Next item I was actually looking to pick up while I was there is the fake up. My wife finally went through her stick of fake up. You know, this one right here in the color 101 light. So that's the fake up stick right there that we just picked up. Um, as you know, uh, concealer on the inside, moisturizer stick on the outside. So it looks like right there. I'm sure you've seen that also. Put that away before I drop it. I uh, also need to pick up another high beam highlighter for her, high beam highlighter. Don't need to show that to you, you know what that looks like. And also to pick up a erase paste in number one fair. Erase paste, good stuff. Never have too many of those for a little concealer. Um, while I was there, I saw these three sets that I figured I should pick up. These are the uh, world famous neutrals. This is the first set. Uh, easiest nudes ever eyeshadow kit. Looks like this. Each one comes with four eyeshadows and two cream shadows. Got a little tips and tricks section in there. So four eyeshadows, two cream shadows in the pots right here. The colors of which are right here on the box. Oh, look at that. I didn't have to take them out of the packaging. So that is the colors that are right on in here. So this one is the world famous neutrals. Uh, the next one I picked up is the World Famous Neutrals Most Glamorous Nudes Ever Eyeshadow Kit, which is this one right here. This is, like I said, the Most Glamorous Nudes Ever. So let's have a look and see what this one looks like on the inside. Same thing, box just like the first one, and there we go, Tips and Tricks card. These are the colors that are in there. Uh, once again, these two colors right here are, oh my gosh. These colors on the inside of this are these ones right here. These are the same colors that are on the inside of this one right here. Uh, that's the second one. The third one, if the world famous neutrals, is this one right here. This one is the 
sexiest nudes ever. The one in the purple box, sexiest nudes ever. This one on the inside looks like this. Uh, like I said, they all come with a tips and tricks card on the inside. These are the shadows that are inside of this one. These are the colors that correspond to this particular box of shadows. Right here. And like I said, um, these are new to me. I hadn't seen these before last time I went in. But I uh, couldn't just pick up one, especially since they're such different colors. So picked up all three of them while I was there. You know, that's the thing. You gotta keep the boxes for everything because every time you open it, it's like opening a brand new product. Every time. Uh, you can ask Jacqueline Hill. She agrees. The next thing I saw was this How to Look the Best at Everything kit in light. Uh, this looks like something good. A little flawless compaction kit in light. Uh, this one looks like on the inside. You open this up. It looks like a book, just like the outside of it. Just like a book. And on the inside, it has the tips and tricks section. It has a professional, a Hello Flawless, the Boing Concealer, the Hello Flawless Powder, and the Benefit Brush right here. So that's what comes in this particular set. Uh, I figured best for her to try out each one before we invest in the full size. Uh, also, while I was there, I picked up a sample of this uh, Sugarlicious set, this uh, Benefit Sugarlicious set, made specifically for Sephora. That we can test out all different colors. Um, that's what it looks like on the inside, the box itself, Sugarlicious. This is the Sweet and Soft Shades for a fresh, natural-looking glow. And on the inside, this is what it comes with right here. Um, the Benetint, right here, the Benetint, the High Beam, the Sugar Balm Powder, and the Sugar Balm Lip Gloss right here. Um, like I said, sample sizes so you can test them all out. Never know if you're going to like it, so I went with this color. Probably going to end up having to go back and get all the other samples too. Then, I was all done with Benefit. Figured I probably picked up everything I need to pick up for the day. And I was walking past, getting my way to the cash register when I passed through the Smashbox section. And lo and behold, they had the part two of the Smashbox Masterclass palette. Now, I'm not sure if you've seen the first part. Let me just quickly show you what the first part of the Smashbox Master palette looks like. This is the first part, part one of the Master palette. Uh, the inside looks like, well, the palette itself looks like this. The inside has all different colors in it like this right here, these are all different colors in the Masterclass palette number one. Uh, and they had the second part of it, so I figured I should really pick that up. So, of course, I had to pick up the Masterclass palette number two. It looks like this. This is the uh, box itself. Let me quickly bring this out so you can have a quick look at it. Inside is, the, is a similar Masterclass palette box. This one is actually in a reflective gold bronze color right here. Uh, and on the inside, the colors are set up in the same way, but very different colors. Uh, this is what comes in this particular palette, these colors right here. Ooh, let me show you. These colors right here in the second part of this palette. I know my wife has been chomping at the bit to get to this one. Like I said, uh, when we got the first one, she went at it right away as soon as we brought it home. But uh, this one, she's been waiting a little while, so we'll give that off to her very soon. Um, that's actually how I picked up in this particular trip, or in this portion of this trip to Sephora. Um, you know, I sometimes you just have to go in there and see what there is. You just really, really never know what you'll find. Please don't forget to come back for the next part of my Sephora haul. I really appreciate you guys spending a portion of your day with me. If you are a loyal subscriber to me, I really appreciate it. If you are a new subscriber, hello, thank you, welcome, I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you like this type of video. Also, subscribe to my channel if you just happen to stumble upon it and you are not yet a subscriber. It's free of charge. I'd appreciate it. I'm sure you'll enjoy it too. Also, you can catch me on Facebook. Kaleidoscope Anthony Collard. I'd love you to be my friend. I know I'd like to be yours. Also, you can find me on Twitter at Kaleidoscope and on Instagram at Kaleidoscope. I really appreciate you taking time out of your day to come spend it with me. You guys have a wonderful day. I'll be seeing you soon. Thanks a lot.